Okay, welcome to my studio. <laughs> So this is where I spend my days working every day and we can go over to this wall over here. So this is sort of half in progress at the moment. This is where I usually store a lot of paintings that I'm currently working on and I just pin them up there and I can sort of see if they're finished and I have them in the corner of my eye. If I'm working on another painting, I can just see them and be like, no, it's not finished or yes, it is finished. Again, sort of similar to this wall. This is all work in progress at the moment. So this is a current painting I'm working on. This is the start of my bar series with sort of girls and cocktail dresses, bar scenes around London. So this is all right at the beginning of this um, series. So we'll see how that goes. This over here is my painting station. This is where I keep most of, yeah, most of my paints and all my art equipment. Um, and generally in the days, all my, all my paints are laid out and my brushes, obviously, which are the best tools ever. I keep my palette on here. Then sometimes I pick it up and I walk to and um, back from my paintings. Um, it's always nice to keep distance from the paintings that I'm working on. So I always make sure I keep a step, step back and make sure that the paintings I'm working on are, are far away. And this over here is sort of bubble wrap and paper station. Um, obviously wrapping up a lot of paintings, shipping them off. Um, it's good to have all that equipment. Now we're coming to my desk here which is where a lot of procrastinating happens. Um, I've got, you know, timelines of all projects, all paintings I want to paint, ideas and goals, etc. So this is sort of my brain area, um, which is sort of nice to keep it in the corner. <laughs> Over here, this is sort of um, what inspires me. And this is again, me learning and trying to teach myself. I often do online courses to keep myself um, learning because you can so get into your own habits as an artist. So it's really, really good to keep doing courses and keep learning from other um, artists and remind yourself the fundamental rules of painting so that you don't get too carried away and lost. And then as we go over to one of my favorite parts of the studio, my lovely doors in the summer, this is just amazing. I open these double doors and um, it's just so nice to feel that um, breeze. And out just outside, actually, there's a tennis court, so it's really nice in the summer. I can hear people playing tennis. These are some little paintings I'm working on. You know, I always do little sketches in prep for a big commission. Um, so it's quite fun just to sort of experiment with color. This one is a work in progress. It's not finished yet. So it's all a bit messy. And as you can see, there's a lot of mess around. I often, when I'm painting, I um, paint on, you know, to sort of get the, the paint quantity right on my brush before I then put it onto my canvas. Over here, this space is generally where I actually put my paintings and paint here. It's nice to walk back and forth from my painting station to where the works are happening. Um, again, this is a lot of work I've done in the past or sort of inspiration. And, um, and this is a reminder of techniques that work. It's good to keep reminding you know again some of the rules and this is just prime examples of what i think works color wise technique wise so i keep that here near my paintings this is a work in progress again for my bar scenes and the, this is the beginning of this sort of whole series of work i love this pose i think this the, the whole sort of setup is brilliant so this is a yeah painting that i am working on these are some of my landscape paintings, a bit of uh, Amalfi Coast, a bit of Cornwall. Um, again, you know, I'm just hugely inspired by the beautiful landscapes of anywhere, really. And then over here, these are, this wall is sort of, I stick to portraits because I sort of, again, this is a reminder of when I'm doing a portrait commission of what works, what brush strokes I like, sort of the, the way I want to paint portraits is all, on this wall and this is a great reminder to me when I'm working on portraits and um, what sort of works and what I need to keep reminding myself of. Um, so generally that is, is my studio. Um, as I said, yeah, I spent every day here. So it's nice to keep it light and keep it inspirational. Um, otherwise I think I'd go mad. So, <laughs> but it is my home and I love it. <laughs>